Uganda has repatriated 57 former Democratic Republic of the Congo rebels back home for disarmament and reintegration. The former fighters of the M23 movement had sought refuge in Uganda after a ceasefire agreement that ended their activities and control of the eastern DRC town of Goma in 2013. Here's CGTN's Michael Baleke with more. Going home after five years in exile, Ugandan officials handed the former rebel combatants together with their dependents to the DRC ambassador at Entebbe International Airport. The ex-fighters have been living in military-run camps in western Uganda, awaiting amnesty granted to them under the 2013 peace deal. Once in the DRC, the former rebels will be rehabilitated before reintegrating them into the community or back into the army for those who wish to serve. Those people that accept themselves voluntarily to go back home, this is a good sign. And to this is, we want to tell the one remaining in the camp to make the decision now to come to the country because we want to build the country. The move follows the bilateral agreement in 2014 which provided for the repatriation of the former combatants who were willing to go back home under the disarmament, demobilization and reintegration arrangement. More than 200 ex-combatants have so far returned home under the program. It is very important because having ex-fighters in the region, in countries which are not their own, is a security matter. So when we see them going back to their country, it's a positive. It's a positive in terms of stability for the region. And that's what our president is focusing on. That's our, what our leaders are interested in, stability of the Great Lakes region. More than a thousand fighters are believed to have fled into Uganda and Rwanda after Congolese and UN forces quashed the Eastern DRC rebellion in 2013. The new DR Congo leader, President Felix Shisakedi, vowed to reconcile the country, calling upon all rebel groups to surrender and work for the development of the country. The DRC government hopes such a move will promote peace and development, but also prevent the defeated insurgents from regrouping. Michael Balekesi, GTN, Kampala, Uganda.